Hey there guys, so I've got back again with another video and today, before we get into the video though, I do want to apologise in the previous video, you may have heard some background noise that was my PS4 you're probably going to hear it again in this video as for some reason my PS4 does sound like it is trying to take off into orbit for some reason I don't know how to sort that out at this point I will find a fix for it in the future but for now we're just going to have to make do with it I apologise again but yeah in this video the new DLC for G GTA the lowrider update I made a video with my initial thoughts on this a couple days ago and I wanted to just give my opinions on it after I've played quite a few hours on it today and in general I think it has quite a few issues most of them are I would say the same issue but I'll get to that in a minute I do enjoy the update don't get me wrong it shows Rockstar has got great ideas for the current gen consoles and the PC and they don't have to cater for the last gen consoles anymore with these new updates they can use the better hardware that's available to them on the new gen consoles and especially on the PC where they're just out of this world compared to consoles in most cases anyway so they can give you some great applications really as it shows these things were never thought to ever come to GTA Online because the 360 and PS3 was holding it back I don't have any issues with the way the update plays I think it works great no complaints on the way it works and plays and feels and I enjoy the Lamar jobs I think they're actually quite fun to play I've played uh, four I think at this point and I started the fifth but I had to leave halfway through the mission I've been playing them with friends as I do most missions just because it makes it easier than trying to play it with some randoms you know the communications there and it just makes it a whole lot easier they're so much fun it just brings a new character to the game that we didn't think we was really gonna get in online and his missions are great I do recommend trying them out. The issues I have in this update though are to do with the costs of everything. The car you see in the background gameplay might not look like much but that car actually cost about 1.2 million dollars to fully build and yeah that's that's a lot of money for a car like that. That car cost more than an adder which at one time was the car everyone wanted which is kind of mind blown really. I saved up two million dollars before this update came out and all that got me was this car and the moon van I believe it's called and that's not even fully upgraded at this point. I actually had to sell my um, T20 which if you've been watching my videos you'll know that's a car I quite liked in this game. It was probably my favourite car but I needed the money and that car would give me 1.4 million if I sold it. So I made the decision, I'll sell it and I'll just eventually work my way back up to get the 2.2 million that I need to get the car back again. I do understand why Rockstar made the issue of money in this. If they're going to make updates like this free they need to sell shark cards. There's no other way of saying it. They need to sell shark cards. It's the only way these updates are going to be able to stay free and frequent. I do... I do see why. But for people that aren't going to buy shark cards, it does kind of make it a pain. Like, I don't buy shark cards. I've bought them in the past and now I just don't really see much point in buying them. I'm not going to be buying them ever again, really. I, well, not for the foreseeable future anyway, because I'd rather just play GTA, do some heists, and just earn the money now. It's a bit easier now that I have a pretty much a full team of four that play most of the same time as me. And that's really it for this update, guys. If you, like I am, enjoying the update, other than the money issue, be sure to like and subscribe for more content. You know, I'll have much more coming out soon. Thanks for watching guys, I've been Surah God, I'll see you in the next video.